What is going on everybody? It's a beautiful day today here at the Motor Coach Store in Bradenton, Florida. And today we found a 2008 Country Coach Rembrandt. This coach has what I think is the best color combination of any Country Coach I've ever seen. Not only are the exterior colors awesome, but the interior colors really tie everything together well. And those of you that have followed the channel for a long time know I'm a big fan of Country Coach. This coach is on the Dynamax chassis. It has semi mono Monocoque construction, the Cummins 600. This is a pre-DEF coach. This coach has right around 41,700 miles and is priced for $277,777. And today I wanna to show you a lot of really cool features that this coach has that we don't see on a lot of other production motorhomes. Let's take a closer look inside of these bays because there's some cool stuff I wanna show you. And boom, we've got all the bays open. Now, when we go into this first bay up here, I want to show you guys how everything is lined with carpet. You see, even the chassis rails are all completely finished out. A lot of production coaches, you're going to see a lot more exposed metal and whatnot. Now, this does have an entertainment uh, Samsung TV right here that will just slide out. You can swivel that as well, all in excellent condition. and. When you look deep in these bays, super clean inside of these bays. You've got outlets here, speakers all lined with carpet. Bay two is gonna be a full pass-through bay with this manual slide tray, again, lined with carpet, super clean. You've got a light inside of this bay. Bay three, another full pass-through bay. Here's a look at our house battery bank. These are on manual slide trays. Looks like Lifeline 8D AGM batteries, battery disconnect switch. Here's a look at your chassis batteries, everything in super clean condition here. I always gotta brag on the detail department here at the Motor Coach Store. This coach has had full paint correction and I've been looking closely for paint checking. I have not been able to find any paint checking on this coach. So those of you that know a lot of the country coaches that sat outside in the hot sun end up with paint checking on the darker colors. But this coach is in the wrapper. And I always like to point out, you know, the reflection on the white paint. It's easy to get a reflection out of a black paint, but when you start making that gold and white look like a mirror, that takes a lot of talent to get this paint on this level and Eddie and the detail team here at the Motor Coach Store are second to none in the industry. The top-notch organization all the way around. I open and close these bays. You can see this is a much thicker fiberglass door. And when you open and close these, you can really feel the quality. You can see everything's super clean in there. There's the bottom of that Cummins 600, but we'll show you the whole engine in a second here. This coach has a little engine oil fill there, a little auxiliary uh, oil reservoir. I love the country coach mud flap here and this coach does have a 15,000 pound towing capacity. I love how these engine bay doors open on the sides and when you look at this paint scheme, the pinstripes are finished out all the way through these fins. Just a lot of little detail in these that I appreciate. And here's a look at that Cummins ISX 600 horsepower an absolute beast with no DEF. And I've had a chance to test drive some country coaches and I'll be honest, with this Cummins 600, this coach really gets up and go. You have no lack of power. And with that semi monocoque construction, it's really one of the best driving motorhomes on the road. The side radiator coach, we have a power 50 amp cord reel right here. Just press this little button to bring that in. Got a huge bedroom slide that I look forward to showing you guys inside in just a moment here, but all oh, just in excellent condition. This paint is popping. And there's a lot of little detail in this paint job, like a fade from a darker charcoal to a gray right here that kind of comes down to more of a silver color. Again, another fade right here from the darker charcoal into more of a silver. You can see that metallic flake up in the paint and the higher profile roof rails up there. So the Country Coach Plumbing Bay, it's hard to believe that this was a 2008 and this just shows you at how well Country Coach finished out their bays. Here's your uh, freshwater gravity fill, your cable inlet, all of your light switches super clean. You have an exterior faucet, little exterior shower there to maybe wash the dog off or whatnot. Soap dispenser, sewer hose storage, all super clean. I like the little Country Coach uh, emblem here. Your black and gray tank flush. 
your city water fill. You've got these little openings here to run your sewer hoses as well as your water hoses. There's access to your water filter. And then this has the Aqua Hot 600D, all super clean. And look at the size of this door. And I've seen the Country Coach rep put all of their body weight on this door just shows just how well built these coaches are. Here's the other side of that full pass-through bay. So you have your two uh, storage bays with the full slide-out trays and full pass-through bays. This front bay that has the entertainment center on the other side also is a full pass-through bay lined with carpet in excellent condition. There's your uh, propane access as well as your diesel fuel. And then this front bay is going to house your HWH system for the slide rooms, a lot of your electrical components. We can bring the generator out all by the press of a button. And I always like to point out when those stickers are just in the wrapper, very clean inside of this bay. Do not paint this, I like that. This has got the ride well suspension. And then there's a look at that Onan 12.5 diesel generator, 812 hours, barely broken in absolutely stunning coach but when we go inside of this coach that's what it's all about There's a few things I want to show you right away. You've got the code entry. And when we open this door, this is a lot wider than a lot of the other motorhome doors. You're going to see all with that country coach inlay and the screen door there with that country coach emblem. Beautiful work with the leather and the different patterns here on the inside of the door here. And all kinds of little stuff throughout this coach that they were thinking ahead. You've got a little drawer right here to put dog leashes or shoes or whatnot. And then your passenger will have a step cover as well. But I love the colors of these floors, kind of light colors. So we've got all the shades down right now. The ACs are blowing ice cold on a hot Florida day. And when we take a look at the ceiling here, not only does this piece show well aesthetically but this also keeps the noise down from those rooftop air conditioning units these captain's chairs are beautiful with the two-toned leather you can see your driver area has a wood grain steering wheel all in excellent condition simple analog gauges you do have your rear view camera a usb port your stereo leveling control, HWH leveling system. You can control your visors, lights, camera views, a lot of good stuff from this panel. We do have a cup holder up here. There's the gear selector for the Allison 4000 transmission. You can tilt and extend your pedals to make it more comfortable. There's your engine brake controls as well as your tag lift. And I really love the entire feel of this coach. It has kind of like a marine feel to it beautiful light colored sofa over here and i like how it curves around we've got a booth over here and just beautiful woodwork country coach was really well known for their woodwork and the craftsmanship and this coach is a fine example of some of the product that they put out now this is like a blue suede couch over here and i really like how it ties in with the floor tiles and that woodwork gives me that marine style feel. And as we get a little bit closer here, you can just see so much detail work on just the, the, just the quality. Let's see if this folds out into a sofa here. So we've got a nice uh, drawer here for storage below. And this looks like a pump for an air mattress. Yeah, this will jackknife down there. And then you can see this will convert into sleeping very easily. And, there is, so this is suede, so that's not stains. That's just when you kind of comb it over, it kind of looks a certain way. So I know the detail guys were, were combing this all to uh, make it look good before I filmed it. Now this leather is all in excellent condition. You can tell that this coach was very well cared for. All the blinds are in good condition. Uh, and I like this booth. Now this booth will extend out as well. You've got plenty of seating with that button tuft on the back and really a lot of space in this coach. 
even with this couch turned down into a bed, you still have a lot of walking room with the slide rooms in. We've got some storage above the booth area, all lined with carpets, super clean. Like this kind of stained glass cabinet in the middle of the coach. It does have adjustable shelving and then more storage down here with adjustable shelving. And this coach does have central back. There's different attachments that will go into that, but it makes it easy to keep this coach clean. A really good size galley here. The first thing that's catching my eye is this beautiful backsplash with a circle design, beautiful countertops with that molded edge. This will actually pull out right here as a cutting board. Cool. There's a really cool feature that this coach has. There's something in this closet that'll go right here. Give me one second, guys. And boom, you've got a little ironing board still in the plastic. Looks like it's never been used, but a cool little feature that Country Coach did to make life on the road easier. And then you'll also have a good amount of drawer space here. All deep drawers with the silverware dividers. And those will slide as well for more storage. Just a very high-end feel. There's all of your remotes, lots of storage. Get a little bit of storage below your sink and then access to your plumbing. Dishwasher here. Fisher Paykel dishwasher. Little uh, storage below there. And there's a look at your cooktop there. And I love how they finish everything out with that same countertop surface very high end and then all the little details like this countertop cover not only has that molded face edge but it also has this little piece of wood right here to really finish it out just giving it that real high-end feel we have a residential refrigerator with an ice maker and water dispenser here on the door this does have a little lock so we just press this button and hold it for three seconds and then now that will unlock the refrigerator and freezer door all super clean and as we go into the middle of the coach you've got your air conditioning controls your breaker panels and then some adjustable shelving and I love how we go into the back of the coach everything really opens up from this middle bathroom going into the bedroom there that is a king-size bed we've got a ton of countertop space uh, around your sink there that's got to be close to three or four feet of countertop space about a five or six foot opening there going from the mid bathroom into the rear bedroom i love the woodwork around the glass mirrors and the sliding doors there there's a second room for your water closet with the same beautiful flooring continuing into this area you do have a second sink here with the vanity and all very high end. I like opening this up to show that 52,000 pound gross vehicle weight. There's the VIN number of this coach. And, and then Country Coach also too, they have all of the different suppliers of all of the different components in this coach listed here in the cabinet door. And there's the old Country Coach customer service number. You do have a window in the bathroom with that nice window box cover as well as a vent with a fan. Storage there above your head and plenty of room around your head there. All super clean. Then you've got a really good sized radius shower and I like that they put that uh, etching in the glass there to give it a little design in that same circle pattern like we saw on the backsplash. Then a beautiful headboard back there that I got to give everybody a close up on. Lots of countertop space on this side of the bed. And then a good amount of storage up top here for uh, extra pillows or bedding or whatnot. More storage over here with adjustable shelving. I really like this. There's a little hole out laundry hamper there. And then some adjustable shelving above that. You have a TV, Samsung TV here in your bedroom, more storage, a little bit of countertop space, and then more drawer space as well. And then back here to the left of the closet, you've got your washer-dryer combo, and then 
adjustable shelving below. Then you've got a closet along the back of the coach here with a little more storage up top above your hanging space. And then there's that ironing board that was in the wrapper. Looks like it's been there its whole life, but that can be put into the uh, kitchen and, and utilized there. All lined with carpet here, everything in really good condition. There's all the Country Coach owner's manuals. This coach is a great opportunity for someone looking for a higher quality coach. It's got the Cummins 600 semi-monocoque construction and there are a lot of great country coach resources out there back in Oregon and then the motor coach store is also a great resource to get work done on country coaches. Now one of the best parts about this coach is it's available here at the motor coach store in Bradenton, Florida. The motor coach store is well known for their PDI process and their detail process. Bradley Twait, the owner here, runs an extremely tight ship and when I come to video these coaches you you can really tell the difference of a coach. It's really been gone through and really detailed outright. When you purchase a coach from the motor coach store, they will have a trained technician spend a day with you, teaching you how to work all of the systems, make sure you understand everything in the coach. And there's really a lot of value in that. You can even camp the night if you want, and make sure you're really comfortable understanding everything before you go down the road. So this coach is a lot of value for $277,777. If you're a serious buyer, you can contact Bradley Twait at the Motor Coach Store. I greatly appreciate all of you subscribing to the channel and liking these videos. I hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again. Mm -hmm.